I pray today with you that you become interested in your own life. Don't become like one of those people that says, well, I've seen it all. I've done it all. You haven't. You haven't even <laughs> gotten past the tip of the iceberg of that that there is to discover about your own life. In Ephesians 1, verse 9, it says, For he who has made known to us in all wisdom and insight the mystery of his will. I pray that you have a new wisdom and insight into the mystery of your life. I pray that you discover things that you haven't discovered before, and it's all positive discovery. I pray that you have a vital interest that keeps you alive, an interest in life that leads you constantly into a greater awareness of God. Jesus told us that if we are to receive the kingdom of God as a child would, we will enter it. When we're trusting, and when we're eager, and when we're humble enough to be willing to learn, we are childlike. And this inner prompting for knowledge and a, and a willingness to pursue it are all part of our spiritual inheritance. Regardless of age, we can maintain a real new sense of curiosity about life. Being curious means to take a lively interest in life itself and our own life that we're living, even that that we take for granted and have a thirst for new knowledge. Being interested in life, you know what it does? It creates an enthusiasm in life. Joy wells up from within and a daily communication with God through prayer and meditation, it keeps our interest on a path of positive experience. Life is the great gift, and we must not ever waste a day by thinking it's the same old, same old. We have to make it new. We have to explore and discover. It helps us to have a greater awareness of our Creator. And we lead a richer, fuller life. God's life of free will is given to us all. And we have the innate ability to use our free will as we learn about life, ourselves, and others. I pray that you have a curiosity about life. I pray that the mysteries are revealed to you, and they are pleasant indeed. May God bless you in your new discoveries.